All right, so we're back with uh, just another quick video today. Um, hopefully this is gonna be something you find helpful here. I'm gonna quickly talk about <clears throat> how to fix the, um, the what they're called just rubbers that they have on the doors here uh, for cars. And when they, um, sometimes they'll begin to sag on older cars. And every time you go to shut your door, the thing's popping out and it's a big pain. So that's been happening with this car. These things have been real tired and I priced them up online and they were absurdly expensive. Something like 120 bucks a piece per door, something I am not gonna pay for this car. So what I ended up doing was simply taking some uh, Gorilla Glue and uh, working it into the various areas here. This is just some stuff that's a little bit left over here. And I should have taken some pictures and video before I actually fixed it to show you how it goes in here. But I've made up some, some nifty little drawings that, that may be able to help. So on, on the door itself, there are these pieces here. There are these little plastic clips uh, that swivel in there. And so they have this, this piece on both sides that the rubber piece here and its holes that you slide into. And so the holes look very much like, so right here, here's what one of the holes looks like here. And to get that in to this clip, <clears throat> what you have to do is hold the rubber um, with one hand here, and then with the other hand, pull it and stretch it over and then slide it back in. And so what I ended up doing Prior, prior to doing that, I used the Gorilla Glue and I wet these areas. That's what you're supposed to do with it because it does expand. And then I squirted some glue in there, you know, a fair amount, not crazy amount because it does expand as you could see down in this area here. You can see the white pieces here that have expanded. But I put the glue in the hole and then I started stretching them over those clamps. And I did that all the way around the door and I had to do it on three doors on this car and there was a little bit of excess as you can see but once that was done I just closed up the door let it sit and now you know that's that's a little bit of a loose part there but all the places where it was connected um, they're they're on there good it checked all the doors they're all solid so we'll see how long it lasts but the glue itself was only like five bucks and it took all of about ten minutes to do so I will take that over um, spending over $100 per door through this. So hope it helps. Um, good luck with it. Thanks.